My name is Brother Bert Bartholomew Brigham, and I wanted to take a moment and talk to you about glory holes. If you see a post online about a glory hole, do not go to them. They are not religious. There is no glory to be found there. I'm a religious fella, so when I saw a post about meeting up for a glory hole, I decided to check it out. And it was in a public restroom, which I thought was odd, but still I show up and I, uh, I sit in the stall and it's weird because the stall I'm sitting in, there's like a hole in between the stall. It like, you know, not only is that wall separating you from the other fellow on the other side, well, there's a hole in the wall and I can like, I can like see that there's someone, you know, like you see the shadow and stuff. Like I knew there was someone in the stall next to me. So I go, uh. Hey there, this is my first time. Is this the glory hole? And uh, I, I hear a man on the other side say, uh, Yes, yes it is. Uh, as you can tell by my voice, I am a male. Uh, normally, uh, you, you know, you don't want, most people don't want to hear the voice because they want to uh, maintain the fantasy that I might be a woman. But uh, if you're okay with it, you know, it being a man on the other side, uh, stick your penis through the hole, and I'll suck you off. So after the guy's done blowing me, we're just chit-chatting, right? You know, he's praising my girth. And I find out this cocksucker's a pagan. I hope that seed that I planted in his belly rithers up and touches his heart. Because there is no heaven without Jesus Christ. That's it for today's lesson. Be sure to tune in next week for some more life advice. My name is Brother Bert Bartholomew Brigham. God bless.